In today's video, I'm going to show you how to color grade your video like a pro in Film or a Mobile. If you don't have the Film or a Mobile app on your smartphone, go to the Play Store or App Store to download it, open up the Film or a Mobile app and create a new project and import your videos to the timeline. Once you're done, you're going to see your video clips on the timeline. So I have three clips that I want to edit. So I'm going to show you a very creative way to add effects to your video. So I'm going to be using keyframes to edit and color grade the video. So first of all, to add effects to your video, we're going choose a point in our video and we're going add a keyframe at the beginning of the video. So right now we're going click on adjust, um, going to reduce the exposure down to minus 39 we're going to leave everything the way it is and we can click on OK. Then we're going to choose the next point of our video where we want to place the next keyframe. I will place it close to the end of the clip. So I'm going to click on adjust. We can make some changes to our video. I will set the exposure as 30. I will set my contrast as 37 to give a more defined look. I will also set the saturation as 67 depending on your clip. You might decide to increase or decrease the value. We are going to set the black level as 19. On the HSL, we can tweak it to our desired look for this video. I'm going to set my hue as minus 92. Saturation is 40 and brightness at 80 and click on OK to save our edit. Now let's preview our video clip. You can see the difference between before and now. In the next clip, we are going to just add a keyframe at the beginning of the video. Click on adjust and click on filter. I will make use of the daily life filter and set it at 98. Go to the adjust tab and set exposure at minus 43. Contrast at 43 and click on OK. Go to the middle, add another keyframe, click on the adjust button and set exposure as 52. Contrast is 80. Saturation is 46. And vibrance is 75. I'm going to toggle on and off the icon to see the before and after look of the clip and click on save. In the third clip, we are going to use a filter called Grim Horizon and click on save. Let's preview our work. I'm going to add music to the track and then preview the video once more. If you are happy with your work, click on the export button and choose the resolution and frame rate, make sure you unthick the watermark and click on the export button to save your video to your gallery. If you are interested in learning more about how to edit better videos with Filmora, I recommend you check out the Creator Hub. It contains tons of amazing tutorials from creators around the world on YouTube. It's totally free. I will leave the link in the description for you to try it out. Check out the videos on the screen to watch more Film Aura related videos. If you found this video helpful, please show your support by dropping a like and subscribing to the channel for more awesome videos like this. See you in the next video.